is Layla and in this video I'm gonna be showing you three new art designs for fall and winter. So I've chosen colors that are going to be trending on the next seasons, but I try to give my own taste when it comes to the designs. So our first nail is going to be a blue roses. The nail polish that I'm using are this one from Revlon. I'm also using a dark shade of blue and a light shade of blue. Also a white nail polish and a green one. And I'm also using a dotting tool and a stick, it can be a toothpick. So let's start here. I have already applied one coat of this nail polish. Just to give a little background for our flowers, you can use a nude color if you prefer a nude color. And I'm going to start drawing the roses using the dotting tool and the dark shade of blue. And I'm basically just going to draw the shapes. It doesn't have to be perfect. Next, I'm going to use a little stick or a toothpick to draw a couple of details uh, to form the petals of the roses using the light shade of blue and the white nail polish. As last, I'm going to draw the leaves using the green nail polish and the dotting tool. So that's very simple, very easy to do. You just place the dotting tool and pull and you form a little leaf. And once you're done with that, you're gonna let it dry well and apply your favorite top coat. On the other nails, I simply apply two coats of the dark uh, blue and that's pretty much it. I really love this color. I think this color looks gorgeous. So that's it for these nails and our next one is going to be a pink purple gradient nails. Uh, gradient nails are still very in so uh, I'm using this nail polish from Revlon which is more purple than it looks in the video. Kind of looks more pink than it actually is. Um, and I'm going to use a metallic silver and a glitter. And a makeup sponge as well. So let's start here. I have already applied a base coat and I'm gonna apply one coat of the silver uh, metallic silver nail polish. And I know that I got a lot of questions about how I take the excess of nail polish around my nails. So this is simply what I do most of the time. And on the other nails, I simply applied two coats of the same color, uh, the pink purple color, not forgetting to apply a base coat before that. So now that our metallic silver nail polish is dried, I'm going to start sponging to form uh, this gradient effect. So I start by the middle, uh, on the middle of the nails, very gentle, very little nail polish. And then I apply more nail, nail polish on the sponge and I sponge it on the tip of the nail and that's going to be a more generously amount of nail polish and that's going to create a nice gradient and you can always apply a little bit more just using the, the brush from the nail polish right on the tip of the nail. And once that is dried we are going to apply the glitter. And that's basically it. Since you applied a glitter on this one, on the gradient one, you don't need to apply top coat, just on the other ones where you have a plain color. Our third and last nail is going to be a fall tree nails. So you are going to need a green nail polish, I'm using this one from Revlon, a orange nail polish, 
also a yellow and I'm also using a black striper and a clear very light color uh, for the background and a dotting tool so let's start here I have applied one coat of this nail polish and I'm going to draw and I'm going to make a sort of a uh, French tip with the green nail polish just like that let it dry for a little bit and we are going to draw uh, the tree using the black striper and the way I did this was really simple I just start from the bottom and I come all the way to the top making some very thin uh, branches for the tree and it doesn't have to be perfect um, once your branches your tree is dried we are going to draw simply a couple uh, dots using the orange nail polish the green and the yellow and that's going to form some really cute fall leaves and that's simply it on the other nails I simply applied two coats of the green nail polish and after a design is well dried you can apply your favorite top coat and that's it, it's done I really hope you guys enjoyed this nail art tutorial um, if you like this video please don't forget to give a thumbs up and subscribe to my channel and I'll see you guys on my next video bye bye